Creating your own crypto token can be very easy and very fast. And in this video, I'm going to show you how you can do it with Third Web. Third Web uh, allows you to log in with your MetaMask wallet and basically deploy ready to use contracts for free and you will get a really cool dashboard to do it. So let's get started. This is going to be a super short video because I want to show you how quick it is. Uh, so once you log in with your MetaMask wallet, uh, I'm currently on Arbitrum to make the costs go down, but you can do it on, uh, on Ethereum mainnet as well as all other L2s. Uh, you can go to contracts and click on deploy contract. Now you will have a bunch of choices here. So you can explore the most popular ones like NFT airdrop, market place account factory, we're going to go with a token. And once you click the token, uh, you can uh, have all the details here, uh, click on deploy now, and you can start with doing everything. So I'm going to write to, to name the token subscribe, or maybe the, the address of my website, PC crypto, the symbol will be also PC crypto.co. And then uh, go to PC crypto dot Go for the rest recent uh, crypto news. Uh, I can add uh, an image if I want to uh, to deploy here. I don't want to do that. I have some kind of advanced configuration also with different like tax fees and and so on. And I can add also to dashboard. But basically, I'm choosing Arbitrum. I have of course a plethora of choices with like Ethereum. A base, uh, Optimism, Binance Smart Chain, a Phantom, and a bunch of other chains. If I want to use them, all of them are EVMs, Ethereum uh, virtual machines, so all the related to Ethereum infrastructure. I'm going to go with Arbitrum because this is a cheap option. Click on deploy now. Now I'll have to do a couple of confirmations in my wallet, but basically this is it. Uh, I'm just paying uh, in MetaMask uh, right now and clicking on the uh, on the MetaMask confirmation. Uh, so still have uh, MetaMask thinking about how much I should pay for the gas. Uh, and the gas on Ethereum is right now uh, 33 cents. So not even half a dollar to pay for the contract. And this will uh, basically add to the dashboard right away. Uh, now the final step, I also have to confirm that with my MetaMask wallet to do it, uh, to add everything to the thirdweb.com platform. Uh, this is a simple sign uh, that you have to do at the bottom to add everything to, uh, to the dashboard. So once it's done and when it's confirmed on the blockchain, it will be added to the dashboard as well. Now, successfully added, I can close it. I can go, you, I have the contract here uh, and I have it, uh, I have it uh, added to the dashboard. Now there are no tokens. So this is a proxy contract with no token tab, but I can head to the token uh, either from the overview or uh, as you can see here, clicking on the token tab or go directly to tokens and here, I can mint new tokens and basically say how much I want. So let's say I want to mint like 1 million tokens, uh, minting them, they will be added directly to the contract and they will go to my wallet. This is what I have uh, confirmed. This will cost me 11 cents right now. So still we're be below half a dollar uh, after minting and uh, deploying the smart contract. So. Uh, this is basically all the uh, all the tokens. Uh, everything is uh, uh, everything is uh, here uh, going to me. Now I can add different permissions or remove different permissions. So basically, if you want to uh, have like really build a token for yourself, you should revoke at some point the admin uh, here or basically uh, I remove the minter so that. Uh, no one can access and mint more tokens because otherwise you could always mint more tokens. But this way, uh, you, you will, if you revoke the permissions, uh, there will be no one that can basically increase the number of tokens. And then, for example, you can burn some of them or airdrop them to some other people or transfer. So if you click on transfer, it's to a single address. Uh, if you click on airdrop, uh, the cool stuff, you can upload addresses so you can add a CSV file. Uh, we can try that. So I have like prepared uh, some kind of a CSV file uh, here that I have to find and I'm going to airdrop that. Basically this, uh, this will be, uh, this will be um, addresses from GMX, the holders of GMX that I just taken from uh, from Etherscan. So those are, well, random addresses, but I guess real people in the end that will get 
my token right now uh, and we're going to add those 250 addresses uh, if you want to prepare this kind of a csv file it's pretty simple there's even a template here uh, you just have to put uh, the wallet address the address column and have the quantity to uh, column. If you have quantity, no quantity column, then basically everything will be assumed to have like one token cent. Uh, if you put the quantity, there will be uh, some more cent and basically that's it. You air click on airdrop, confirm the transaction and you're going to airdrop to 250 uh, wallet addresses. Now this will be more expensive uh, even on Arbitrum. Uh, I'm going to pay right now for here about $5 because I'm sending to so many wallets. Of course, if I were to send to like one wallet, then uh, the cost will be uh, very, very low and it will still be below $1. But because I sent to like uh, 250 addresses at once, uh, I did the airdrop and uh, this is what happened. So I can right now see total transactions, total events uh, being happening here. And also I can go to RBScan and see my token right now deployed on RBScan. So this is the PC crypto token. As you can see, deployed to 250 people. Uh, the contract is already verified. That's the cool stuff with Third Web. You know, you have everything verified here. Uh, you can also click on the token tracker, see the token, and you can see that there are two, 251 holders. So myself and 250 other people of pccrypto.co uh, token. So basically, that's it. That took me like a couple of minutes at the very most uh, and you can see that i have not only created the token but also airdropped the token to 250 people already as you can see with third web it's really easy i really recommend uh, going with that because uh, you don't have to pay for anything of course there's some kind of pricing if you want to do it at really industrial scale but uh, and also do a different stuff like do a marketplace stuff like that but for simple tokens and even airdropping tokens this is very very simple same thing goes for nfts so thank you for watching subscribe to the channel and see you in the next video.